what do we call, what type of altimeter is that? It's a pressure altimeter. Uh huh. Right. Yeah. Why do we call it a pressure altimeter? Uh, because we're adjusting for the the pressure, the local pressure. Okay. Does the altimeter know at all what height you are above sea level? No. Not a clue. No. Nope. Right. The only person who knows how high you are on the yeah. plane is the pilot. Yep. So what is the altimeter able to show us? Height above what? Height above the if whatever. If it's not sea level, it's pressure what? Pressure that I set. Good. Good. Our altimeter is able to show us height above whatever pressure we set. Let's think about why. Say that again. Let's think about why. Is it always 299 or 2 at sea level? No. Good. If it were always 299 or 2 at sea level, we would make an altimeter that like this it in. that had 299 or 2 without a Colesman window uh -huh. or the ability for us to adjust the pressure. Uh -huh. Because it's not always 299 or 2 at sea level, uh -huh. and our altimeter only shows us height above a pressure, we have a problem. On the one hand, we want to indicate MSL or AGL. MSL. Good. On the other hand, it's not always the same pressure at sea level. Uh -huh. Correct. So we need to have a way to manipulate the instrument. It could only show us height above a pressure. Uh -huh. It's not always 299 or 2 at sea level. Correct, yep. So if we wish for the altimeter to show us height above sea level, and it can only show us height above a pressure, which pressure does it make sense for us to plug in? If the altimeter could only show us height above a pressure, uh -huh. and we wish for it to indicate height above sea level, oh, which pressure we better plug in? Well, the, the current pressure. At, uh, at, sea, um, at sea level. At sea level, yeah. Right? Uh-huh. And that's how we make that into an MSL altimeter. Yes. Yeah. We want the altimeter to show us height above sea level. Uh -huh. It is not always the same pressure at sea level. The altimeter can only show us height above a pressure. Which pressure does it make sense for us to plug in there if we wish for it to show us height above sea level? The pressure, pressure. found at sea level. Yeah. Or the pressure found at the point where we wish the altimeter to indicate a height above. Does that make sense? Yep. That Good. Makes sense. Which is why your altimeter settings will always pretty much 99% of the time be in the vicinity of 298 something to 3010. Zero zero. Uh -huh. It will never be different than that. Why? Because you're always plugging in sea level pressure uh -huh. at the area you're in. So even if you're a big bear uh -huh. at six, 7,000 feet above sea level, your altimeter setting will sound very similar to this. The question is why? The answer is because we're plugging in the pressure at sea level in big bear's area. Yeah. Does that make sense? Yep. Perfect. So that's a lot of confusion out there. So the altimeter is a pressure altimeter. Uh -huh. It can only show us height above sea level. Yes. Right now, 299 or 4 is at sea level. Uh -huh. Let's say 3010 zero zero was found at... Actually, it's not a good idea, uh, example because 3010 zero zero results in that. But if 3010 zero zero was at sea level, by plugging 3010, zero zero, we would have 113 or whatever field elevation is. Uh -huh. Does that make sense? Yeah. And so... Two nine nine four. So whatever's found at sea level in our area, we plug in so the altimeter could show us height above. But it's a pressure altimeter. Uh -huh. It has no clue where sea level is at. The yeah, only person the, the only person who knows where sea level is at and what pressure is found there is the pilot. Yep. Make sense? Yep. That and that's how we turn that pressure altimeter into an MSL altimeter. Easy? Yeah. Good. Last thing. If we plugged in the current pressure found immediately around us into the altimeter, what will it indicate? The, what will it indicate on the MSL? Uh, on the altitude window. Well, it'll ideally uh, indicate my, my current altitude, like right here at the field. So we said the altimeter can only show us height above a pressure. Yeah. If we plugged into it the pressure found right here, uh -huh. what would it indicate? How high, are how, hard, how high are we above right here? Uh, yeah, 120. Is that That's above sea level. Yeah. How high are we above right here? Well, zero. Z yeah, zero. Oh, yeah, yeah, on the on the on the ground. Right. Sorry, I was trying. To so if we plugged in right. the pressure found right here, uh -huh. we said the altimeter can only show us height above a pressure. Uh -huh. If we plugged in the pressure found right here, what height will it show? 
Zero. Zero. Good. Yeah. I love that you did that. So what's a way for us to find out what pressure is found immediately around us? Just put zero, put zero on there. Yeah. Yep. Does that make sense? That makes sense. Are you guys very busy today? Not at all, surprisingly. It's currently 2981 immediately around us. Yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. In order for us to show MSL, uh -huh. we must plug in the pressure found at sea level to show the height above that. Yeah. Pressure found at sea level is given to us on the ATIS. Uh -huh. It's 299 or 4. And the result should be right MSL. There. Is that clicking? Yep. That is that is clicking. Yep. That's what the altimeter knows to do. It only shows us height above a pressure. Which pressure? Whichever one we plug we in, put there. in. Yep. Why do we put in the sea level one? Because we wish for it to be an MSL, MSL. altimeter. Yeah. Easy? Yep. Easy. Yep. Good stuff.